the LG V20 user here and today I am doing a video on the LG Styler 3 for Boost Mobile guys this phone finally appeared on Boost Mobile's website this morning um so yeah the Styler 3 is now here as you guys know the Styler 3 is not bit from the Styler 2 from last year um there's some there are some slight improvements but I'm still a little a little disappointed on the specs and shit so um yeah that's my opinion so yeah, I'm on Boost, on Boost Mobile's website here. So I mean, yeah, here's the Styler 3. Um, the Styler 3 got announced like, uh, like probably like a couple months ago and stuff. So that's what the phone looks like here. So uh, it looks really nice. Uh, on the front of the phone, you got the uh your front-facing camera earpiece for 5.7 inch display there on your screen there. It doesn't it doesn't have an app door, but I think you can add one via settings and stuff like that. And you got your LG logo. It has like a a curb, uh, curb edges and stuff like that, so that's pretty cool there. Um, so it's been a picture here, but it's not showing up. Basically, I'll just show you a picture of the front. It's basically the same picture as this, but it's just uh, tilted the other way. So th that's the size pen right there. Um, it tucks into the front, so there's a place for the for the size pen to go. And also, it has some features on it. It has uh. Uh, some neat features on it as well, and I think the uh, pen accuracy is probably has improved over the style of two from last year, so that's good. Um, so this is not no uh, S Pen, you know, this is not no Galaxy Note or nothing like that. This is a, a poor man's Galaxy Note, as it might guys might call that. Um, so there's a size pen right there. Um, this is side of I don't have anything on the side. Uh, don't have anything on the uh, left side rather back of the phone uh, you'll have your uh, camera your flash and power slash fingerprint scanner yes this does have a fingerprint scanner yes I'm surprised they kept the fingerprint scanner on this one I'm surprised they did because they crapped out on the specs a little bit here uh, you hit the LG logo and it looks like the volume key is on the uh, left side of the phone your power, your power buttons on the back obviously Excuse me, that's what the fingerprint scanner is. So that's pretty dope. Uh, so when they bought the phone like this, the fingerprint scanner, it's a nice feature to have. I use it on my B20, and I think it's a great feature to have. Um, you also have your speaker down there. Um, and then this is this is this is this, this, this is the front again. LG Styler 3 lets you read into it, guys. The LG Styler 3 lets you do more than ever before, but that slides 5.7 inch HD display and enhanced interactive stylus access contact quickly and securely using the fingerprint sensor. Its 3200 million battery also lets you talk, text, and browse longer, and a powerful octa core processor lets you multitask with lightning speed. The LG Styler 3 is once the 999. But it is currently out of stock, um. So you know that sucks. But hopefully they'll get it back in stock soon. Okay, I know I know a lot of people are excited about this phone. So um, yeah, I think it's been out of stock ever since they got posted to the website here. The phone was supposed to be released yesterday, but I don't know what the fuck happened with that. So if it's in specs on the Style Three, um, right now Boost Mobile and LG is running a special promotion on the LG Style Three, um. Uh, it's a premium offer. I suggest, it, it suggests if you guys get this phone, take advantage of this. It says buy a Style 3 and get a $25 gigabyte credit or a 32 gigabyte, gigabyte micro SD card. Limited time offer. Learn more. Um, I think it'll probably take you to the uh, take it to your website that you can uh, register and all that and uh, sign up for it and all that and uh, and and and, and the chance to win or whatever. Um, yeah, if you guys want to get more information about this promo uh, deal for for the Style 3. Check out Dragon It's Warfare's video on that. I will have that link in the SpaceX video. And also, if there's a website that you need to all uh, get to to uh, get this over here, I will try to have that link as well. So, um, that's pretty cool. Um, I would take both, but I think you'll get one. I suggest you just take the uh, the $25 giggle pay credit. Take that. Talk time is up to 25, 25 hours. 3200 minute battery. Get up to 25 hours of talk time from this long lasting lithium my um, battery. It is removable, so that's good as well. 5.7 inch HD touchscreen display with stylus. 
Enjoy bright images and rich video on the go with this stunning HD color display with resolution of 1280 by 720. And get more done with the embedded stylus. Get more done with the enhanced stylus, my bad. 4G LTE, LTE Plus. Switch the simultaneously between Sprint's nationwide 3G and 4G LTE networks. And the all new LTE Plus network, red level LTE Plus offers faster service, faster service, and double the network capability. Capacity LT Plus offers faster service and, do and double the network compa capacity and increased speed. 1.4 GHz octa core processor. I'm surprised they didn't cheap out on this. You know what I'm saying? But it is what it is. But it says do more with the things you love with the power for 1.4 GHz octa core processor. Enjoy breathtaking speed, jaw dropping graphics, and long battery life. This is where this is where people are are going to get pissed at right here. The RAM and the ROM, sixteen gigabytes of RAM, two gigabytes of RAM. So when I did the video on the Solid Three a couple months back, that will be uh, linked in in the Switch Box video as well. Um, it said that it, that the Solid Three is going to have three gigabytes of RAM, and two gigabytes of RAM. I was like, all right, you know, pretty damn cool, right? But then I was like, oh no, not again. They the LG did it again for the fucking third year in a row. LG Sprint has done a third year in a row, but you do get, uh, yeah, the, the memory is kind of a disappointment. But for 180, you do get, you do get, you do get what you pay for here. So, um, you know, it's kind of expected. You're not, you're not, you're not gonna get a 32 gigabyte uh phone for uh 180 on prepaid. No, you're not. Even though it's 2017, dude. But I'm just saying, it's kind of a disappointment in my opinion. Says keep your favorite music videos and, and important files at your fingertips. Android 7.8 Nougat. That's pretty damn good. I love Nougat. I have it on my V20, obviously, and it's a great OS. My favorite feature is the multitasking thing. And 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 the ability to be able to reply from the notification bar. So that's pretty damn good. Says Android 7.8 Nougat. Enjoy the most loved features of Android. Easy multitasking. Customizable home screens and deep interactivity. 13 megapixel rear facing camera, 5 megapixel front facing camera. So, no change from last year's uh, Styler 2. Capture high resolution photos and red video with the 13 megapixel rear facing camera with flash and the 5 megapixel front facing camera. It's perfect for selfies and video chatting. Mexico roaming capable, stay connected even when you are traveling to Mexico. Um, I think you need uh, uh, a separate plan for that. Voice from incapable. Stay connected even when you are temporarily outside the Sprint network. And you think you like what 50 domestic minutes, 50 domestic voice minutes a month or something like that. Mobile hotspot capable. That's really good to have. Oh, uh, it doesn't cost anything for hotspot on boost. It's included in your plan. So this phone has it, so that's great. Never get stuck without an in internet connection. Turn your phone into a. Wi-Fi hotspot, only go access, I'm not sure what the fuck's going on there. Sorry about all that uh, crazy shit there. Fingerprint sensor, this this is a big one. Uh, this is like probably like the, you know, big one here, so, oh, uh, yeah. Um, quickly wake up and unlock the style three using the security and simplicity of your fingerprint. More features on the uh, style three LTE Plus with Two by twenty carrier aggression, Wi-Fi enabled, built-in flash and zoom, HD voice, three point five millimeter headphone jack. I think the headphone jack it's at the bottom. Oh, uh, micro SD card, slide up to two terabytes. Gorilla Glass, thing, Gorilla Glass three. I think I'm not sure. Bluetooth four point two and a bit of stylus. Specs on the um more specs on the stylus three here. It weighs five point three ounces, five point seven inch touchscreen display. 720 by 280 pi 720 by 1280 pixels, 258 ppi, 2 gigabytes of RAM, 16 gigabytes of ROM, talking time up to 25 hour 25 hours, 3200 minute battery. It is removable, so that's great. A Qualcomm Snapdragon processor, 1.4 gigahertz octa core. There's the dimensions of the phone there. What you get in the Style 3 box is you get the uh, Style 3, the micro USB 2.0 charger, important information booklet, some card, and some card, 
installed in battery. Um, if you guys need more help on your Styler 3, check out device support from Beast Mobile and the Bell Hub. Yeah, with different things, how to set up Wi-Fi, Bluetooth on, on your Styler 3, and also different features on the Styler 3 as well. So go check it out. So yeah, the Styler 3 is now here on Boost Mobile, and um, yeah, this, uh, I am, I am, I am, I am a bit disappointed. The only thing that I'm disappointed in is the um, is the memory. Um, I think when I did the Style 3 video a couple months ago, I said I think it said it's supposed to have a 1080p display, but they all uh, cut that out too. So, so, you know, the fan looks very nice. It really looks very nice, in my opinion. It does have a, a fingerprint scanner, which I am personally surprised. For 180 bucks and prepaid, I'm surprised they didn't take that out. And it has an octa-core processor. But the only thing that I have a, like, like a big gripe on is the memory. Two gigabytes of RAM and 16 gigabytes of memory. Um, that's a um, that's slightly less than 32 gigabytes of memory and 3 gigabytes of RAM. That was on the Styler 3 when I did the video on that a couple months back. Um. And no, uh, yeah, the battery is a bit better. 3200 milliamps, it should last you pretty good. It should last you a good while. It should last you a lot better as it would if it was on the V20. The V20 has a quad HD display, and the Style 3 has a 720p display. So better, the battery life will be better on the Style 3, obviously, because it has less pixels, and its display is not as great as it is on the V20. But... The display should look still. It's just display should still look pretty nice as well on this phone. Um, yeah, and if you guys notice, it doesn't come with the LG Stock messaging app. It comes with Google Messages and shit. Um, so uh, yeah, just keep that in mind. And um, yeah, just let you guys know that the Style Three will come with Google Messages app, not the Stock LG app for some reason. Uh, the X Power had that as well, so. It's kind of uh, kind of interesting there. So um yeah, if you guys want want to get the Style Three, um, check your Bismo store now because it's currently out of stock on Bismo's website. But however, they will, they will have it back in stock soon. Um, so yeah, so they got any any, any accessories for this? Like, they have no accessories for this. Alright, all right. Okay, all right. So yeah, this is Style Three right there, guys. From Boost Mobile, it's one hundred nine nine nine. Um, it does have LTE, of course. LTE Plus, Mobile Hotspot, Fingerprint Scanner, and with Nougat. Um, yeah, there's some there's some good things to love. There's some good things to love about the phone, but uh, they crapped out on the uh, memory, and I think the display they crapped it out a little bit as well. Cause I think when when they did the Style Three video a couple months back, I think it said 10, 1080p display. So. But other than that, it's it's still it's a budget phone, so you do you do you do get what you pay for here. But a fingerprint scanner is really nice to have, and um, yeah, a lot of people would probably like that because you know, yeah, there's no NFC or anything like that, so you can't do Android Pay or anything like that on here. Um, so uh, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, guys. It really helps me out a lot. Please check and subscribe. Thank you very much for watching my video, yo, and like I said, in the next one, peace out.